Hi there, you lovely fly fishing maniacs. My name is Ken Person. Welcome to the Sameo channel. I got some requests from friends outside the Swedish borders asking me to please translate my old knot tying video to English, and of course I'm happy to oblige. So here it is, three basic knots that are quick to learn and super easy to use. Perfect in low light conditions and cold weather, even for a half blind old fart like me. I'm gonna show how to tie them with and without forceps, so tag along! First I will use my trusty old forceps for the knots. It's a tool I always keep at hand, I put my nipper together with it so it's close by. The forceps makes all the knots easier and quicker to perform. The first one is the bait knot or sink tie knot. You thread the fly and you make it hang in a loop. Let the access line hang out on the side of your index finger. Now you put the forceps through the loop and turn it around 5-6 times. You open the forceps and fetch the loose end. Pull it back through the loop. Wet the knot and tighten it. Now you use the nippers to trim the excess. And now we do the tippet knot or the surgeon knot. You put the leader and the tippet side by side, make a loop with both lines. Put your forceps through the loop and make two turns. Open the forceps to fetch both ends. Use the forceps to pull through all the way. You wet and tighten and use the nippers to trim the excess. Now let's try the backing knot or the leader knot. Lock your forceps 10-15 cm, it's about 3 or 5 inches up on the backing of the leader. Put the line you're attaching back on the forceps to the handle. Take the loose end and make 3 or 4 turns backwards, not too tight. You grip the coils, keeping them firm while carefully open up the forceps. Thread the loose end back through the coils. Thread the fly line from the opposite direction. Spread out the coils nice and even while carefully tighten the leader or backing. Use your fingernails to make the coils sit nice and firm. Before you finally tighten it up completely, pull the knot close to the end of the fly line so you don't waste too much of it. Wet and tighten. Trim the excess. This makes for a very small and straight knot. And now we do the same thing without forceps.
So here they are, the three basic knots every single fly fisher should know. Easy as pie. And if you practice a bit, they are so fast and easy to tie. You know, life is too short to be annoyed over bad knots. Work smarter, not harder. Thanks for watching, and as usual, if you like this video and want to see more, please click on the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. See ya!